And I say two cops, everyone does two cops together. Like this, two cops! A high energy warm up for a high performance combine. Ask a lot of questions. A lot of you guys are in different spots in your process. This is what you're here for. This is where you guys want to learn. NLU Sports kicking off this year's multi-sport combine series. First up a development opportunity for up and coming baseball players. I'm here because I want to get like looked at it, obviously and this is going to help by like getting my numbers, getting my stats up, trying to see how far I can push myself. Jacob Doucette is a 16 year old outfielder who posted some impressive numbers in the physical testing. He was one of the standout performers in the early stages of the two hour session. Doucette plays for the Niagara Falls Falcons and has high hopes for a future in the game. I definitely hope to play in at the university or college level because that's been my dream. Well, my dream has been to play in the MLB, obviously. That's I would be, wouldn't be here if it wasn't that. But uh, I feel like I'm, I'm pretty athletic. I'm, I have a lot of speed and uh, obviously I can jump pretty high so I, I want to take that to like as far as I possibly can and keep growing my skills. The physical testing consisted of four stations, the broad jump, vertical jump, pro agility and 10 meter dash. All of this providing data for scouts and recruiters and it was all run by Fizzelite based out of Richmond Hill. For us it's all about making sure that these guys understand why these metrics are important and to help them get the best out of each test and giving them cues and feedback so that they understand uh, why these metrics matter in their sports. Asa handles the strength and conditioning side, I handle the medical side, but they're not separated. They're absolutely uh, integrated because if they're not strong enough, it will show in the tissues. When I check their tendons, muscles, etc., we will be able to identify the individual um, issues. Then when they head over to Asa, he's able to measure and show that those things do matter and, and have performance outcomes. Fizz Elite's motto is excellence through integration. They've developed a solid partnership with Next Level U Sports. They work very well to help people to get into college and uh, achieve their goals uh, sporting wise. Whereas we are the ones who make sure that their bodies are in shape to achieve the goals that they're gonna achieve. This combine was held at the Yard Athletic Center in Cambridge, the new home of the Midwest and Ontario Bearcats. Daniel Hancock is a pitcher from Cambridge who plays summer ball with the Bearcats. To get the numbers you want right before the season, you know, we got a month and a half to ramp up before. It's great to get your baseline numbers in before that so you know where you're at going into the season. You don't wanna come in knowing, not knowing where you want to be, where you are at. So this is a great thing, thanks to NLU for setting this all up, this great facility the Bearcats have to use. So definitely a great experience so far here. Bearcats are doing a really good job of providing opportunities for the kids, playing in some top tier tournaments, top tier development. You know, we're at their facility tonight, you know, the ability for the kids to work year round. And that's something that we always want to preach is, you know, finding their best opportunity, finding the right fit. And that's something that this organization is really priding themselves on. So we're really excited to continue this partnership and we're great that tonight was able to be successful in partnership with them. Putting an elite program together with elite instructors and elite coaches and then adding the NLU aspect in for college placement, college recruiting, online platforms, uh, just like what you saw at the, the uh, Combine tonight. Uh, that'll definitely help them get some exposure that they need to get to the next level. Having the ability for those guys to give the education piece to the kids and the families to understand the different routes, what they need to do to get to, to the next step in their baseball career uh, definitely helps. And just having the knowledge and the contacts that they've, they've brought to the table for us helps a lot. Stay tuned to 509 Sports for part two in our series. We'll check in with the pitching prospects, find out who threw the hardest pitch and how the Waterloo Warriors were involved in helping these young student athletes. Hi boy Mac. Yes sir.